Hi everyone. Today we're going to have a look at assigning circuits to a panel when the panel does not have the rating or the distribution system rather assigned to it to fit the circuits. And this is a typical issue that comes along when new users try and adapt templates to their needs. Shown on the view here there is a panel that is currently set to 277. So lights with a 277 voltage will attach to this panel. Our systems or our light over here has a voltage of 240. So are we able, when these lights have been added into a circuit, to select this panel and we see we can't assign it because the voltages mismatch. And that is a good thing. To understand this better, let's have a look at the electrical settings on the Manage tab. Under the MEP settings, there's our electrical settings. Firstly, the voltage. So over here we have the 277 voltage definition, that's its name. The nominal value is 277, the minimum 260, and the maximum 280. Now because 240 does not fall within the range of 260 to 280, it is rejected. We may add voltages or delete them. In this case, there are components placed within the model that utilize the 240 voltage system. And we can't delete it. But if it did not exist, we could create it or add it. Again, the name 240, nominal value 240, minimum value 220, maximum value 250. In other words, our lights, which have a voltage of 240, are going to fall within this range between 220 and 250. So first things first, define the voltage definition for the components that you need to add to the circuit. Then the distribution system. This is the similar type of system than what we want to create. You can see it's indicated a high voltage to a low voltage. This is from a low voltage to a high voltage. Typically these are used in transformers and those within panels. And then single or three phase power. And then the configuration refers to the transformer setup. Delta or Y configuration. the load to load and load to ground voltages. We need a new distribution system. Stepping this time from 480 to 240 volts, we're also going to use a WYE configuration. Three phase. Four wire. 480, 240. Now we should find that we can select this panel. However, we haven't set the voltage yet. My, not the voltage distribution, my apologies. Select the panel. There we can see our 240, 280, 240 distribution system. We tab to the circuit and then we select our panel. No problems.
So when you need to hook these circuits up to your panel, make sure that the voltages are correctly defined and the distribution system for the panel is correctly assigned. I hope you've enjoyed this short demonstration and that it helps you in your setup for your company template or for the work that you need to do. And if you need any help with regards to your MEP workflows, please contact us here at Micrographics so we may be of service to you. Until next time, enjoy Revit.